Have you ever wondered why there's no strawberry or watermelon essential oil? This is because fruits don't exist in perfumery. I'm a perfumer, so let me explain. Essential oils are most commonly extracted through steam distillation. We have a tank of water and we have a tray above it with a perfume substance like florals or herbs. The scent molecules in florals are oil soluble. So as the water evaporates, the steam passes through the flower and carries the perfumed oil. This way the water can be drained out and we're left with that perfume or essential oil. Unlike florals, fruits are mostly made of water. So the scent molecules are water soluble. There's actually no oil in the fruit in the first place that can be captured as an essential oil. Fruity scent molecules are also very delicate and they can't withstand the high temperatures used in extraction processes. So you might ask why not use a different method? The fragility of the fruity scent molecules makes it very expensive to extract them. It also yields a very low quality product. So how do perfumers actually create fruity fragrances? Before I answer that, leave a comment with your favorite fruit and I'll try to recommend my favorite fragrance with that note. The answer is synthetics. You can analyze the actual molecular compounds in a fruit and then recreate the same synthetics in a lab. Perfumers then take all these separate synthetics and assemble them together as an accord. Sometimes they also add in other materials to add their own twist on that fruit. 